Find your AV. Oh, flip. Oh, they're just spawning here. No, bro. Game's about to end. No, bro. We went on. <laughs> if you don't drop a like in five seconds, man, then uh, I mean, absolutely nothing will happen, to be fair. But if you do, you'll turn into this thing right here. Main thing, though, make sure you do subscribe to the channel. We're on that road to 200,000 subscribers. So go ahead. Click the subscribe button, man. As I swear, we're on the final stretch to Damascus right now. Like, I've missed some videos here and there on certain days just because I kind of wanted to get this done as soon as possible. Especially with it being double weapon XP this weekend. But basically, I've got two more weapons left. Two more weapons until I've got Damascus. Pretty easy weapons as well. I wouldn't say they're too difficult. In comparison to what I've done, especially with this joint right here. Look at this stupid weapon. This was only annoying because it flies 50 million miles in the air and then comes back down. And if other people are trying to get the launches done in a same game they would just fire their missile straight at their uav and destroy it easily and my missile still going up just wasting time but i got it done eventually so all i've got to do now is the rpg and the combat knife i've not actually leveled up the combat knife or the rpg yet but they'll be pretty easy to do especially with we got double weapon xp for two more days and then we've also got the season one mosh pit which has got vacant and shipment i just i never play vacant i literally only search for shipment just because it's a really small map the spawns are crazy and i'm easily getting those launcher kills man it's insane with double weapon xp as well <laughs> I find that the launches are actually pretty easy once you get like these defender medals out the way you get the uh, attacker ones out the way as well once you get those done you can literally just shoot down like UAVs and personal UAVs count UAVs all of them and you pretty much count to like every other challenge that's here to be honest uh, yeah, yeah. yeah lads realistically I should have Damascus by tomorrow or the day after like it really won't take long it'll probably be my next video though oh sick but yeah just play shipment <laughs> shipment literally sped up the process by so much like a lot look at that I could just fire my launcher and get kills. So many kills. Like I'll end the What the flip? I'll end the game with probably, I don't know, maybe 30 kills. That's a lot for a launcher. You got to think about it. That's a lot. Especially when if you're running around like ground war or something like that, you won't, you definitely won't get as many kills. You've actually got to work for them. Me? Nah, not at all. <laughs> Look at it. The thing about it though is technically reverse boosting. Well, they're down near. I, I would say just play shipment is to be fair because you are just running, knowing that you're going to die every second. And me, low key, when it comes to like destroying streaks, I don't really care if I die. Like, if you really need me to die for you to get your personal radar or something, I'm happy. I'm happy to do that. But I wouldn't be surprised if people looked at my stats after this, you know what I mean? And said, wait, yo, Brad's reverse boosted. <laughs> I had uh, comments recently of people looking at, you know, my stats and like COD tracker and stuff or maybe to see me in game just like multiple times either killing myself or just dying a lot on purpose when they expect me to be doing something like insane. Yeah, it might seem like I'm reverse. Oh, see what I mean? <laughs> Don't care if I die. It definitely might seem like I'm reverse boosting. I can understand that. Nah, I'm just trying to get these camos done as quick as possible. I'm sorry. I'm really just trying to get them. They might spawn on me. Oh, they did. <laughs> you see what I mean? Wait, why would you not play this? Nah, but seriously, this is definitely, you know, uh, sped up the whole process of me getting the launches done. I can imagine, like, the javelin, for example, would be extremely annoying to get complete. But for me, it took me less than a day. Like, I can't imagine having to play ground war and just getting, you know, and just getting, like, one-off kills every so often, man. Like, what I would do, you'd have to, like, sit from one corner to another corner because if you sat in, like, the middle of the map, you'd be too close to a target. You can't actually fire... Oh, hold up. You can't actually fire the uh, javelin if you're too close. So, you kind of have to be as far away as possible. So, if I'm here, I can shoot across there. Do you know what I mean? you got to shoot at the opposite side rather than being, you know, in the middle of the map. The only counter to this, to be fair, is when people... Oh, that's a triple! <laughs> the only counter to this is when people use EOD. That's the one thing that can throw you off. Use EOD, it's a little bit annoying. But I've never run into a game where every single person in the actual game is using EOD. Do you know what I mean? So, even then, still, you're going to get some kills. <laughs> Crazy part is as well, you'll probably get your weapon, your launcher to max level after three games. Three games on shipment, it'll be max level. Trust. That's how insane it is. It's damn near cheating when it comes to this cabos. But again, basically, <laughs> you basically reverse boosted as well. Oh, and they spawn on the HQ. That's the great thing about it. Spawns flipping insane. I'm almost convinced that I could fire my launcher anywhere and it would still get a kill. Like, that's how insane the spawns are, bro. Sorry, <laughs> I had to do it. I'm sorry. I'd say the only annoying challenges are the objective ones, but they're not even that difficult. If they've got, if we've got the HQ, or they're capturing the HQ, and I fire at, 
bro. What the flip? And I fire at them. That counts as an attacker. No, if uh, we play domination and I stand on a flag with captured and then get a kill, that counts as a defender medal. And people, you know, sometimes get confused with the javelin one as well. All you have to do with that is fire the javelin up to where it might get a kill and then run on something you've already got. If he gets a kill while she stood on it, it's going to count as a defender medal. You don't actually have to be stood on it while she's firing it, which is cool. Really, I don't think it's as difficult as everyone else made it out to be at all. Sorry, I, I had to. I'm probably the most toxic player right now. The great part about doing the launches as well is I don't mind that you get streaked. Because once I've get I've got my uh, missiles back. Hold up, let me let me die. I don't really care. Hold up. <laughs> this is why people think I'm reverse busy now. I don't mind if I die. Wait, there we go. Alright, now I can take out the streaks. I've not actually took out any streaks with this. I don't know how difficult it is. Oh my. I think I got pushed though. Did I get that? I, I did. I did. Okay. Yeah, it's not that difficult then. Nah, it's not that bad. Okay. Alright. Why did you have to do that then? Yeah, boys, I'm telling you. This is the wave. This is the wave. Oh, you got another veto? Say no more. There we go. Easy. See that? 74 kills. 74 kills using the launcher and, of course, the M4 a little bit. Look, I got the most kills in the game. I'm top of the leaderboards. Well, someone got the same amount of kills. I mean, but I don't mind. You know what I mean? It's mad. I don't care if I got 59 deaths. <laughs> See, look, and I already got like a bunch of camos already. Like, come on now. It's just too easy. Already level 16. I hadn't used it before. Maybe in gun game. And it's already level 16. I've already got all of these camos, you know, to be able to start doing things. So, yeah, defender awards, attacker awards, they're all I need. Once I start focusing on those, it will be extremely easy. I might start focusing on those now, actually. <laughs> Domination shipment. This is the best thing because once they've got a flag and they keep spawning on that. Oh, wait, we joined late? No, wait. No, 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 no. That's not what I want. Offense, you see? You see? Offense. Hold up. I want to destroy that. I got a kill as well. Okay, I'll take it. Just got to focus on them being near a flag. Offense again. The near a flag is going to count as an offensive uh, kill, which is just mad easy on this game where if you're stood anywhere, you're pretty much near a flag. It's almost difficult. It's almost difficult not to get offense kills. Also, you don't really have to worry too much about the streaks just because, yeah, you're going to die anyway. So, it's not that big of a deal. Bro. There we go. Sorry. It's only bad when you play against Sweats and you've all got EOD on. That's the only downside I can think of. But still, you're going to be getting offense medals. <laughs> you see how I'm getting it? See? Offense. Like I said, it's only annoying when you don't, when you have EOD on you. Another offense. Oh, double. Oh, trip. <laughs> Yo, bro, what the flip? Offense medals like it's nothing. <laughs> Bro, it's so easy. They're defense medals as well, I think. You know, like, on the flag that we've got, you see, like, it's just the shipment, and so many of these situations happen, like, quite often to where, I don't know, you're just getting a lot of these challenges done, like, really, really quick. I'll be honest, it's a lot easier than it should be, for sure. I feel sorry for the people that were doing this uh, before. Like, oh, that's it. That's how you do it. So, okay, it makes sense now. That's broken, bro. I'm telling you, but it's so good for challenges. And it's double weapon XP. I couldn't ask for anything better. 42 and 62 I went. <laughs> Let's see how many of these we actually got done. So, we got 13 uh, Defender Awards, which is not too bad in one game. And 21 Attacker Awards. That's... Bro, we got halfway through that in one game of shipment domination. That is not how it's supposed to go with the launches. I'm telling you. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yo, none of these guys have got <laughs> EOD on. This is the easiest thing. Okay, all right. That's the final... Uh, offense medal that I needed. I need defense medal. So, uh, they're a little bit... I would say they're a little bit more difficult to do. I could have got one there, low-key. Okay. I mean, I don't know if it counts, though. That's a defense. If I get on B somehow, then it should be... Oh, wait. This will count. There we go. If they've taken the flag just, like, a little bit, then it will still count as the defense medal. Pretty sure. 
Yeah, well, that did. 65 kills. We should have ranked it up a lot. Might like, That's definitely the uh, offense ones done. I don't know about the defense ones. All right, so level 29. So we are two levels away from being maxed. But then we've got all the attacker ones done. 40, done, easy. We've got, uh, okay, we got 26 of the defender ones done. Once we get these done, it's literally, it's literally just a kill streak. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Another one. <laughs> oh yeah, we already got it. We already got it done. How mad is that? Now I just need to take out streaks. I've already got all the other ones done. It's just taking out streaks. So, bang, bang. Yeah, let me spawn up quick. No, someone else took it out. <laughs>